What's up everyone? Glad to have you back on my channel. I hope you're having a good day so far. I'm excited to try crushing this workout. Corey Hall's Intermediate Bar Brothers routine. Seems like a good preliminary for the Bar Brothers requirement, which I'm now training for, trying to demolish that. If you haven't already seen my video of me attempting the Bar Brothers requirements and failing, go check that out. It's pretty cool. All right, now let's take a look at Corey's routine before we get started. All right, so looking at Corey Hall's routine here, we can see that it is two to three total cycles. I'm going to try to do three. It's five minutes rest between the cycles and 30 seconds rest between each exercise. So that means you'll do the seven muscle ups, you'll take your 30 seconds, pull ups 30 seconds, so on and so forth until you make it to the last set of muscle ups then you take a five minute rest and repeat the entire cycle. Okay, so it looks like it starts off with seven muscle ups. That's pretty straightforward. You can either do that on a straight bar or rings. I'll be doing this whole thing on rings. But then we've got seven pull ups, seven dips. Dips can be done on parallel bars, rings, chairs. You can get creative. There's push ups, sit ups, jump squats, and then some more muscle ups. All right, let's get this started. All right, it's time to boogie.
Now I get to take my five minutes. Definitely a bit harder on the rings. I just didn't have a good bar set up to use, so yeah. I'll probably just cut the reps down to five on these next two cycles or something. Okay, now I'm gonna try to move you guys a little bit. Yeah, for some reason this time I felt like filming a video pretty much all in one clip. That way you guys could actually see me do the whole routine from beginning to end. It's going to be a little bit weird having to move the camera around while recording, but I figured it'd be kind of a cool little mix-up. For those who aren't already aware, I'm not sure if he still is, but I know that back when I found out about Corey Hall a few years ago, he was a member of the Bar Brothers, and this is his routine I found on their page in the intermediate section. So that's how I found out about this routine. But there's actually quite a few cool workouts on the Bar Brothers page. I'm probably going to do another few videos on some of those. Trying to prepare for these Bar Brother requirements. I'm going to try again here in a few weeks before I fly back up to Alaska for my uh, visit. But yeah, I'm going to keep trying this until I smash it. I want to get into the Bar Brothers. I feel like that's one of the biggest next steps for me in my journey. Yeah, it's pretty nice actually having rest. A Bar Brothers routine, there's just no rest except for walking from one thing to the other and it's just like, oh, your body just gets suffocated. And so, the dance continues.
try to do one more cycle here. I'm going to have to drop the reps on all of those exercises though. Go with three on the muscle ups, then five on the rest. For some reason I just never quite realize how much harder these workouts are on the rings. I always feel so much more confident in my performance on the bars and then I go to the, the rings which introduce the instability and it just makes it phenomenally harder. So how are you guys doing? All right, time for the last cycle. I'll try my best. Don't laugh at me if I mess up too hard. You can laugh a little bit, as long as you're laughing with me and not at me. Because I'll probably be laughing too. seven in the push-ups, whatever. I forgot to rotate the angle before that last cycle, oh, the camera angle, uh, sorry guys. One final set. Will he be able to do even a single rep? Find out on the next episode of, well, pretty much right now, actually. So I just realized, apparently, my camera won't record any longer than something like 25 minutes, 30 minutes it cut out my last cycle of that workout. But whatever, the first two cycles were 
the most cool anyway. That third one was like half the reps and yeah, definitely fun trying out this routine. The rings made it quite a bit more brutal. I think next time I'm going to try to find a good spot. I'm going to try to find my best. I can bring my dip bars too. That'll make it easier to find a good spot. See how well I do on the straight bars. Also stay tuned to watch that because then you'll get to see just how much harder these rings are than the bars. Also, if you are a person who's trying to take calisthenics to the next level, if you've already mastered the basics, get some rings. Those things have helped me with my progress so much. All right, well, it was fun having you guys along. I hope this routine helps you figure out how to get a little stronger. It was fun. All right, have a good day, everybody. Peace.